Hello everyone. In the last video, we have discussed about how to insert shape and the various options inside that. In this video, we will see about how to insert smart art, how to insert chart, how to format chart, design chart. So let us start. Smart art is a graphic or a visual representation for information and ideas. So there are various smart art options available. We can select any layout or this. And we can draw or organization chart, Venn diagrams, and many more. So let us start it practically. So as you can see over here, insert smart art option. You click here, which is Useful tool for drawing. So there are various options. List. If you see called this list, these are the smart art list options. Then process. If you want to draw a system flow chart, a workflow flow chart, you can use these arrows. Then there is a symbol called a cycle. If you want to represent any environmental cycle or water cycle, you can use it, then hierarchy. For organization chart, you can use it. Relationship, so here you can represent a relationship. It may be useful in a company like this. Many times we see this in more. So this is a Venn diagram, example of Venn diagram. Then matrix, you can represent your information in terms of matrix. And pyramids. So sometimes we come across with this kind of pyramid to, to show your information. So let us see this hierarchy. Suppose I am clicking on this hierarchy and click on this OK and I am selecting this one. Click on OK. So if you click on OK, you will get this kind of format. And there are various options. See the changes and you can click on here. You can select this. I have selected this one. You can also apply the color. So level wise color. So first for level one, top level, middle level and bottom level. So level wise color you can apply. And if you want to apply this to this size. You can apply it. So let us do it normally, make it normal. And you write here. So I am creating a organization chart for education organization. So here I am writing principal. Then white principal. Vice principal for senior senior college here vice principal for junior college then you can write here HOD head of the department science. Head of the department, art, head of the department, commerce. So, likewise, you can create a chart. If you want to add more shapes, you can add shapes here. So add shape. Add shape after add shape, before add shape above. So I would like to add shape below. So likewise, you can add shape. This option is also available here. If you want to extend this, uh, Exchange, 
the position that is left to right, right to left, we can do it from this right to left. Okay. The whole branch of this is exchange. Expand. Same thing you can write here with this. Type your text here. Under this, you can write. So then suppose I write here HOD. Computer science. So it is being added. So likewise, we can create an organization chart. You can change as per your requirement. So this was our previous chart. Similarly, go to the so I'm going to create one more page, create new and insert smart art. I need to select this pyramid and click on OK. So you can type here also in the text pane and that will be reflected in the image. So in the it is reflecting in the image. So here I am writing basically. In the lower level, there is this thing called as CPS transaction processing system. There is a system in the middle called as middle management information system. And at the top of this pyramid, I would like to represent executive information system. So in the business organization, there are three levels, worker level, manager level, and top executive. So that I'm going to, I would like to display with the help of this triangular diagram so like this you can create various organizational charts i'm again creating one more page and so insert smart art space cycle we can draw cycle We can represent the various college entities in the cycle also. So I am here writing DBA, BCA, DBA, IB, MCOM. DCOM. So this, we can also change the shape like 3D and then apply the color. So this is basically useful for creating templates, advertisement in newspaper. So this is what the smart art graph is. So similarly, you can create a smart art and there are various options with process, cycle, hierarchy, relationship, matrix, and pyramid. You try all this, so that's all for uh, creating smart art option. So we have completed smart art. Now we will see about how to insert a chart. So let us take a new page. So for inserting chart, go to our insert tab and select this chart. Again, you are able to see the various chart styles. So we have column chart, and again in the column chart, we have sub charts available, different types. So these are all are the column charts. Suppose I select this line chart, these all are the line chart. Suppose I select this pie chart, these all are the pie chart. 
बार चार एरिया चार स्कैटर टॉप चार सरफेस बबल चार रडार चार तो देर आर वेरियस ऑप्शन फॉर क्रिएटिंग और डिस्प्ले इन द चार्ट so for this example i am going to select the pie chart and a very basic structure for pie chart i am going to select so as soon as we click uh, select the chart excel sheet appears over here and it is showing you our data and you can change or you can apply your data so i am here writing cricketer's name or player cricketer name and their run score so for example sachin dhoni rahul azhar and then you can run so as soon as you change this data and it is reflected in a chart and here we began so this blue color is reflected for the chain this color gray brown color is for dhoni gray color is for rahul and yellow color is for azhar so i am going to maximize this and i am going to close this excel now we have a so maximize this so likewise you can create a pie chart and again there are different color color options are available and many colors are available here so select as per your requirement as per your choice if you want to so if you select this one to get data again this excel sheet appears over here So I'm going to close it, and I don't want to change anything over here. And if I select this one, I can right click over here and select this one, add data labels. So all the runs are available in the particular quarter. Right click and select this. Format data labels. you can also change the uh, apply the color to that particular number or data label if you want to apply it in a center see all this are displayed here in center so right click and format data label click on the format data label or if you don't want to display the score or the data label you can select the top sorry you can select this okay. so click on edit again the excel sheet appears so there this is also available from this option and right click in if you do the right click this edit data label option is also available so this is how we can insert a graph regarding format chart and design chart we will see this in the next video thank you all of you